Oh, hello, 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 hello. Good morning. I said good morning. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, go. It was good evening. Good night. I don't know. Look, you guys. I'm super excited. Amen. So, you, look, you guys. I am on tonight. Amen. Because I wasn't on today, but I hop on you guys to tell you guys a testimony. You guys know every morning I come on and I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and talk. Because I know you guys, it's a Friday night. What do we what do we do now on Friday nights? Amen. So look, you guys, I'm super, super, super excited, you guys, because you know I've been coming on every um, um morning between nine and eleven a.m. in this group, right? And I always come in, amen, with strategies, with tips and tricks, amen, things that can help you, amen. Um, you know, go to your next level. So you guys, I had an encounter. Somebody say encounter. I knew you guys are like, maybe some of you guys are in your bed. Some of you guys are probably out. I don't know, but you guys are gonna see this video. Hello to all the replay viewers. Share this video. Share if you care. Amen. So I'm gonna stop acting silly, you guys, because I have an awesome testimony. So you guys, as you're coming in, as you're logging on, don't forget to share this video. Whenever you see this video, it's like it's like phenomenal. I want you guys to know God, Most High, He's still operating in miracles, signs, and wonders. That's why I just love about Him. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I'm not gonna I'm gonna stop babbling. Amen. So on this week, Amen. I I on this no on last week. You know, I said, you know, in my prayer time, you know, I'm like, you know, in my prayer and meditation time, I'm like, you know, most high, you know, Elohim, you know, I want to experience encounter. Cause I remember when I first got saved, um, you know, I say encounter, you know, like angels, right. And, you know, I haven't had that encounter, you know, in a while. So, you know, I'm like most high, you know, Elohim, um, I want to experience, um, the angels that you have assigned to me. And I said that on last week in the midst of just, you know, meditating and this, you know, speaking with him. And so, you know, went on, you know, I forgot all about it, you know, continuing prayer, continuing worship. And on the night before last, I got home. Amen. Well, actually me and Pastor Curtis, we got home. And the thing about it is he dropped me off because he needed to go back to the store. Right. So he, he dropped me off and I came into the house and when I got into the house, you know, I, um, I, I started hearing noises in the house, in my house, in our house, I started hearing a lot of noises. So I'm like, you know, what is going on? And I felt like the, I felt like someone was in the house, you know, and I started hearing things, you know, like somebody just tumbling upstairs and, you know, things that is going on in one of our bedrooms. And so I'm like, I, at this moment, I call my mom. You guys, this is a, this is a phenomenal testimony. Amen. So I call my mom, you know, to get somebody on the phone with me. And she was like, so, you know, so I'm moving around. She's, and she's hearing the noise. So my mom is saying, is, why is CJ making all that noise? I said, CJ is not here. I said, um, Curtis is not here. CJ is not here. I'm like, I don't know what's going on. I said, all I know is, Whoever's in this house, amen, or whatever, whatever's in this house, they're about to find out. They're in for a treat in a couple of minutes. That's what I said, right? So after that, you know, um, the, the noise is kind of like settled down a little bit. And at this time, maybe a couple of minutes after, um, you know, Pastor Curtis came, he came, you know, came back home. He returned. So then now at this point, you know, we're sitting down and, and maybe it's like five minutes in his arrival back home, you know, um, we started, we had like a big bang in one of our bedrooms, it was like a big bang. So it was like, I said, I told you, I said, something, something or someone is in this house. I'm like, I, when I, I got home, you know, you dropped me off. That's what I heard. So he heard, we heard a big bang in one of our rooms. So, you know, he jumped up, he was looking, you guys, he was looking, amen, for his gun. Amen. I'm like, some, maybe somebody's in the attic. They're hiding out. I don't know what the deal is. So we heard the noise came from one of our bedrooms, right? Matter of fact, it's one of our, is our studio room, right? So then he's looking for his gun. He went, came in the room 
and something fell, a door. And it was crazy. You know, when one of our bedrooms, we have like a sliding door. Now, there's nothing wrong, amen, but the door just fell. Amen. He was like, what in the world is going on? So, lo and behold, after that, we found out all was well. In, into that night, we just it just felt like, you know how you can be like home and you can feel like the presence, like somebody's there? And that's what I felt. I'm like, somebody is in this house. You know, but it wasn't like an evil um, feeling or anything. And, and I'm like, you know, it was like a peaceful feeling. And, and that night, right, we um, usually, with our, with our spiritual parents, we have like, you know, prayer, you know, three times, we you know, with corporately. So after we got a prayer, I'm like, this presence feel real heavy. I feel it. So, you know, I just bypass it. And lo and behold, on last night, so last night, um, um, me and um, Pastor Curtis, we on the phone, even with our spiritual parents, right? You know, having our um, discussion, just talking in general. So in the midst of the um, talking, um, at the end of the phone call, um, Prophet Sora, Prophet Sora began to say, she said, um, she began to describe certain things in a, one of our room. She said, I see this, um, this studio is set up and I see, you know, different things. And, it's a, and she, she pointed out a particular bag, amen, one of our um, bags that we literally just got, amen, with some equipment in there. And she said exactly where the bag was at in the corner. So we're looking like, okay, now we know, you know, I didn't tell her anything and he didn't tell her anything and we didn't say anything to them. So then, you know, Prophet Sean began to prophesy some things. And before, at the end of the call, about the end, Prophet story went like a little deeper. And she was like, in this corner, it's like, um, that where that bag is, she said, the uh, angel is there. And she said, you had a visitation, amen, um, from the um the angel, she's about the angel is in that corner. So and 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 we you know she went in further in the prophecy and things of that nature. And I'm looking like, oh my God. I have never, I didn't say anything. Watch now, watch this, you guys. This is like day, not even this is not even like hours. You know, um, after you know, we having this encounter in our house. And she began to, she called the angels, they called the angel name. I can't remember exactly what the angel name is. And me and um, Pastor Curtis, we just laughed. We were like, look, we were having encounters the night before. <laughs> Literally, last, the night before, because it wasn't last night, because I talked to, we talked to him last night. We said the night before, we literally was, we were having an encounter where it was noises, bangs, and all kinds of stuff. We knew that some, someone was in the home. And it was like, wow. We were like, wow. And, and, and I'm like, like, all I can do is just laugh. And I'm like, you know what? Because I asked God. I'm like, God, you know, I want to see, amen. I want to see evidence of, of my angel, you know, amen. And here is the next night, amen, that he do. And then he allowed the angels to encounter that angel in this house. Matter of fact, in the same room that I'm in right now. And watch this, you guys. And, and we came. She said, when you guys get there. But she didn't know what he was going to do, which I, I did. So she was like, you can even feel sometimes that, sen that the presence of them, you know, you can feel like heat and you can feel things of that nature, right? So watch this, you guys. So then I, we, 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 I got, we got home last night after we spoke with them. So we came in the room, the actual studio room that we, that we do. I, I do my live videos in, in the room I'm in right now. So I went there and I stood in that very spot. Amen where she was prophesying about where the angels were, the angel were. And I went there and it was, it was heat. It's this intense heat and it's intense presence. Like it was like hovering over me. I even feel it right now. Seriously, literally. Amen. Seriously. I'm excited you guys, because God is still showing miracle signs and things that make people wonder. Seriously. So I'm standing in that actual place, that position, that spot. And I'm feeling heat, intense heat, and I'm actually feeling like a presence, seriously. And I'm like, wow. So I'm like, Pastor, I'm like, Pastor Curtis, you know, come here. And he stands there. He was like, it was like a peace, literally a peace. Amen. And and we felt the heat. So I'm like, oh my God, 
you know, the angel literally is here. Matter of fact, as I'm speaking, I can feel the presence of that angel even now that's in this room. And you will say, well, prophetess, or oh, Yolanda, what are you saying? Whatever you, and this is the thing about you guys, which prophet story didn't know. This, I literally, when we pray, I pray in this particular room doing our corporate prayer, amen, with SMI. And I pray in this room, you guys, and the three times out of the day, the three times out of the week, two times out of the day, and I pray in this particular room, and whatever is like, where, wherever you're, you're, you're praying and you're worshiping at, he would actually meet you in that place. Even, I'm telling you guys, even as I speak right now, I can feel the presence of that actual angel still in this room. Seriously. Amen. So I wanted to come on and share that testimony because I shifted the page. Amen. And I, I wanted you guys to know that wherever you begin to um, worship prayer or whatever, and you begin to do it, like the scriptures say, in spirit and in truth, God will, he will always leave his evidence. Amen. Literally his evidence. Amen. And I'm just super excited about that. And I said, Lord, I want to see, you know, I want to feel, I want some evidence of the angels that you have. And she began to, you know, give me some details about the kind of angel and things of that nature. Amen. In that. So I'm excited, you guys. And it's, and even, you know, your, your covering, you know, telling you, you know, exact things in your room that haven't. Now, they've been in our house when they came down to meetings in the past, but they have never been in our room. Matter of fact, they have never been in any room but one part of our home, literally, you guys. And to know and to say a detail, look, God is using Prophet's Torah in this hour, you guys. I'm serious, for real, for real. Amen. Speaking of that, and which is not a pitch, but she will be back to South Carolina you guys, listen, I'm telling you, she will be back to South Carolina in August. But the one thing about this, you guys, seating is limited. She's coming back to the, um, I am a supernatural and prophetic, prophetic Proverbs lady conference. Not only Prophetess Tori going to be there, but Lucy Masi Walker, amen, author, amen, CEO, amen, of black girls, rock, amen. She's going to be there also. But I'm telling you guys, and I, I, I want to get more in detail, amen, but I can't until after. I, so I'll do the other part of the of this testimony. I can't do it now, amen, but I'm, I'll do it later because God is going to do something phenomenal in this conference. I'm telling you, he's already seriously like showing himself. Even I asked him one small thing, you know, I'm like, you know, I want to see the evidence of, of, of my angel. Amen. Cause like I said to, to you guys earlier, you know, I, in the beginning part of when I got, in, when we got into, you know, um, to the, um, to the glory rim and things of that nature, you know, I saw in my angel, like three of them back then, but I haven't like sensed them, you know, I know they're protecting me cause he said he give angels rule over us. Right. So, but I, I, I didn't have that. I didn't have that in, intense encounter and I just wanted that intense encounter literally. And he, he has given it to me. I'm like, Lord, this angel is welcome for as long as you have him. Amen. Here. Glory be to God. So you guys, if you're desiring to even go higher or even understanding in the supernatural, look, I'm telling you guys, you want to be at this conference, the Supernatural Proverbs Conference. And guess what, men? You are welcome. Now, Thursday and Sunday is going to be at Agape. But watch this, Sarah, Friday and Saturday, it, we're going to be on an island at St. Christopher, amen, conference center, amen, we, we, I have some rooms on hold, amen, so if you want a room, amen, definitely inbox me, but this is the part I love about it, excuse me, impartation, listen, it's something where you actually there. And you don't have to worry about the husband, the kids crying, you know, work or anything. You're there. So that weekend, it's going to be like supernatural. I'm telling you. So if you want to go higher and higher and higher, he says in his word, he said from faith to faith, faith for faith to glory to glory. So if you want to go higher, you need to be, I'm serious, at this conference. Amen. And I thank God that the, the anointing and the supernatural that he has placed on, on, on prophets to our life. And that's phenomenal. 
amen, when somebody can prophesy and they don't know anything, parts of your house. And even an angel, she didn't, she didn't know about that. What I said to God prior to, amen, and then bam, God manifests himself. And guess what, you guys? It don't take Elohim long. It does not. It doesn't take him years. Look, when I asked him to have an encounter with that, with, with my angel that's, 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 that has um, charge over me, it was like literally like maybe 12 hours later, maybe 12 hours later. Amen. So you guys, that's it. I want to hop on my page to give you guys my testimony. Amen. So you guys be great. Amen. You guys make this supernatural Friday night this weekend, your best supernatural Friday night ever. And this weekend, love you guys. Don't forget to share this testimony. You know why? Because there are so many people out there that want to encounter you know, the Holy Spirit, want to encounter, you know, God, you know, his knowing that he is there. We know he's there, but he will give you actually tangible evidence that he's here. Seriously. Amen. So you guys, that's it. I love you guys. Be great. Be great. Be great. Be great. Be great. You guys have a blessed and a prosperous night. I'm Yolanda and I'm out. Love you guys.